are working with a large data set on multiple worksheets, you may see the same matching values in both sheets. There are times that we need to find those matching values and clean our data. Hi, I'm Ellie and in this tutorial, I will show you how to find matching values with functions and formulas in Google Sheets. Let's get started. I have this large data set in this sheet. In the first step, I would like to find and highlight match values in the first column of scores. Since I want to highlight the scores, I should use conditional formatting to write the function. So I go to the Format tab, Conditional Formatting. Now this panel will open on the right side. Under the Single Color tab for the Apply to Range field, I choose the score 1 column. Now I should type custom formula. So I open the format rules drop down list and select custom formula. For our aim, I can use the countif function, which returns a conditional count across a range. So equal sign count if open parentheses. Now I should type the range that is tested against criterion, which is column B. Then the criterion, B1. Now close parentheses, and more than one. I like to change the color of cells to light yellow. As you can see, the cells with match values are highlighted. And done. You can also use a dollar sign for exact cell references as a range. Now let's compare two columns with each other. In this case, the applied range is columns B and C. Again, the custom formula is for finding matching cells in these two columns, type equal sign B2 equal sign C2. Now change the color and done. OK is found and highlighted duplicated values. Now to compare data from two different sheets you'll have to make other adjustments to the formula. You'll see, conditional formatting in Google Sheets doesn't support cross-sheet references. However, you can access other sheets indirectly. Let's do it. I select the column, which is column B, then Format tab, and Conditional Formatting. I choose Custom Formula, all right, equal sign B2, equal sign, indirect function. Now open parentheses. Here you should type the name of the other sheet. So, quotation, my sheet is sheet 2, so sheet 2, then the column, A column. Quotation and close parentheses. All right, now I change the background cell color and done. The match values highlighted. As you can see, the duplicated values just highlighted in this sheet. If you want to highlight it in the other sheet too, you should use conditional formatting in the next sheet either. Let's do it. I select the column. Format, Conditional Formatting, and Custom Formula. Now I type the formula in this field. Equal sign, A2, equal sign, indirect function. Now open parentheses, the name of first sheet, 
in column B. Quotation and close parentheses. The duplicated cells highlighted. Now what if the entire row with records in all columns appear several times in your table? Let's find duplicates. As before, format tab, conditional formatting. In this situation, I want to type a formula that if the entire row were appear several times, make it green. So, I type the formula in this cell and then I copy and paste it in the selected field. So, equal sign, count if, open parentheses. Here I need array formula. So array formula, open parentheses. A2 column, which is fixed with dollar sign, with F4, and B column, F4, and C column, F4, and close parentheses. Comma. Now A2, fix it with dollar sign, and B2, F4, and C2. Now close parentheses, more than one. As you can see, the rows with duplicated values highlighted. In the end, if you want to clear a conditional format rule, highlight the cell or the range and go to the Format tab. Down here, you can use Clear Formatting, which clears all formats. But if you like to remove just conditional format rules, go to the Conditional Formatting and this panel you will see all rules. Now you can click on the bin icon and remove the rule. Alright, these were some methods to find duplicate in Google Sheets with conditional formatting. Alright, my tutorial finished and you learn how to find matching values in Google Sheets. If you like this tutorial, please hit the thumbs up and do subscribe in case you're not subscribed yet. For the next, I suggest you to watch this tutorial to improve your skills in Google Sheets. As always, thanks for watching. Have a good time.